so in this video i am going to tell uh, you guys uh, how to create ipa file uh, within a minute so earlier uh, we were creating ipa file uh, using uh, archive option from the xcode menu so creating ipa file using archive work option we are taking 15 to 20 minutes so uh, using uh, this method you can save save your you know 10 to 20 minutes so i'm going to tell you here step by step so i have taken one sample app so uh, so first you have to select your device so if if you have no device then you can select generic ios device right and one more thing uh, here you have to uh, resolve code signing issue i believe uh, you are uh, aware how to do code sign uh, in your projects so i'm not going uh, in detail there i'm just uh, i'm just telling you how to create ip here so once code sign succeeds so you can select you have to select products option from xcode menu and then build so if the build is succeeded and uh, if there is no code sign in uh, and build it succeeded then you can see here the option products earlier it was red but now it's uh, blue so you can select and right click on that dot f file and so in finder here is the dot f file it is the ex executable file and to create that f file into ipa file you just need to create a payload folder remember that so the there's a there's a syntax to create folder so the folder name should be payload so you can drag a file into payload folder and then compress and then change the extension zip to ipa file that's it so you can share this ipa file to anyone uh, who's uh, whose device UDID is registered uh, in your provisioning profile so I believe uh, watching this video uh, you will save your 20 minutes time please guys if you like this video please comment under comment section and subscribe and press subscribe button bye